Welcome. This is our uh, uh, last Sunday of our finishing up our uh, First Timothy series, and uh, uh, today we're coming as uh, Nick and Carl, and not, for now, not Timothy and Paul right right now. So, uh, so one of the things that occurs to me in this series, Paul is very concerned about the whole false teaching, mm-hmm. uh, which really parallels a lot of our world today, I I would say. Um, And he's so concerned that Timothy not get wrapped up in the things that will distract him from the overall plan of of following who God is. Right, right, exactly. Um, And that's such a dangerous trap to fall into. And we saw it early on in the first chapter with Hymenaeus and Alexander and how there were, they were shipwrecking their faith and shipwrecking other people's faith and um, just the danger of what false teaching can, can lead to. And it's interesting, uh, Paul knows Timothy and he knows Ephesus and, and yet that's still a big concern mm-hmm. for him. Um, and in this passage is gonna be about uh, fleeing the things that had happened in, in the last, for us last week's passage uh, fleeing ungodliness, uh, discontentment, um, anything that would lead to, he had a whole list of, last week's sermon I called it sickness, just the whole unhealthy things that end up being harmful desires Mm -hmm. and and all that. And uh, so this week he's still talking about some of that, uh, but at the same time then, He's talking about things we're supposed to pursue mm-hmm. or chase after instead. Yeah, yeah. And so we've got this idea of, of fleeing and pursuing and chasing after and kind of how they work together uh, in the same, same, at the same time. So I wonder if we can kind of take a glimpse into Timothy's life as he's reading this, this portion of the letter from Paul. Yeah, let's let's look and see what that might have been like for him. Oh well, man, I've been reading this letter for hours. It all gets so long-winded most of the time. I think I, I think I'm just gonna take a quick nap before I finish the rest of it. Just just a couple minutes. Timmy, Timmy, pay pay attention. Remember, I didn't just say only flee, but it's pursue or chase after righteousness, godliness, faith, love, steadfastness, gentleness. Oh man, glad that was just a dream. Oh man, yeah. I really can't live with discontentment and fear and running away from those things. Instead, I've got to chase after godliness and righteousness and faith, things like that. So it's not about living in fear, it's about chasing after those things. 